Hey y'all, I'm Jay Maxine and welcome to or back to my channel. I'm so glad you're here in today's video, comma, y'all. It's what I eat in a day, gut health edition. We'll be sharing with you what I'm having for breakfast, lunch, dinner, possibly a snack, depending on how full I am. For those that are new, I lost 65 pounds by changing up my eating habits and incorporating exercise. If you like these kind of videos, guys, please give it a huge thumbs up. Don't forget to comment because I love to chit chat and get to know people. Definitely subscribe because I want you to stay because y'all, it takes a village. And hit that notification bell, that way you're notified every time I upload. Thanks guys. All right, you guys, now I'm gonna start with a shot. So this is my organic apple cider vinegar infused with ginger and turmeric. So I'm gonna have this. Cheers. It's a good help. Woo. Well, that was good. But I need something to wash it down a little bit. Probiotic, organic probiotic sparkling water with a lemon. There we are. It has 50 calories in it. All right guys, let's get into some food. So first, breakfast. Now, y'all, I'm a waffle girl. I am a waffle girl through and through. I prefer waffles over pancakes, but for whatever reason, I have been craving some pancakes. So, I'm thinking gut health. We're gonna take the flour out of it. I'm going to use old fashioned rolled oats instead of flour. I'm gonna take this and I'm going to put it, you can put it in a food processor, but I'm just gonna use the magic bullet since it's just, you know, I only need a little bit, so something small and compact. I'm gonna take this, blend it in there. I'm also going to add some organic flax seeds to the pancakes. This is really good for, I'm about to say heart health. Gut health, I'm pretty sure this may be good for your heart, but y'all take what I say with a grain of salt, do things the way you're supposed to do them for yourself. I'm also going to probably use some maple syrup, wheat germ, y'all, if you've been on this channel, you have seen wheat germs in my food. I will put a sprinkle. I'm going to use some organic um, coconut oil to cook with, honey, yeah, I don't know. Sometimes I just need honey to put on the top of something, so this is my little sweetening agent. Um, I do have some vanilla extract. I also have almond, so I don't know if I'm gonna use both, maybe just one. And also, I'm just gonna use like a pinch of baking powder because it kind of helps them fluff up a little bit. And I also am going to use some yogurt. This is just plain Greek yogurt and an egg. I will show you guys everything I have below and then let's make some pancakes, okay? We're gonna need about a half of a cup, half of a cup, y'all. I'm stepping up and trying to trying to actually use these measuring tools because y'all I'll be eyeballing everything. So we're gonna take this half of a cup. We're gonna put it in here. Then So I'm just gonna take a little bit of the baking powder. Maybe like that much, yeah. Just a little, just, just a pinch. Now I'm gonna put everything in here. I'm like, I'm not gonna start dirtying up dishes, just cuts. So we're gonna add our egg. And then, 
We're gonna add a little bit of vanilla, probably a teaspoon. But again, guys, you know what? I'm gonna eyeball it. There. I love vanilla. I think I'm gonna skip the almond. So we're just gonna do vanilla. And then we're gonna do a little bit of honey, a tablespoon. Boom, okay, a little more, I want it a little sweet. There we go. <laughs> this is the organic coconut oil. We're gonna use about a teaspoon. Here we go. Okay, two and a half tablespoons, so. One, two, and then let's do like a little half. And I'm gonna add the wheat germs. Again, guys, I'm just gonna eyeball a little bit. Here we go. This is the consistency that I'm looking for. Y'all, I also um, added flaxseed. I just forgot to record it, so sorry. Now, while that cooks, we just want to cut up a little bit of strawberries. And I washed some, some blackberries. I'm just gonna add those to the top. You don't have to leave yours on as long as I do, but I like for the edges to be like crispy. Ooh, y'all, it smells so good. Look at these. So I like for mine to go in between. Nice looking short stack. Smells so good, but I just want to show you guys again. Oh my gosh, here we go. <gasps> oh, let food be thy medicine and medicine be thy food. Y'all, I'm about to devour just all of it, okay? Listen, y'all, try this. Okay guys, so now it's time for lunch. Excuse the mowing outside. For whatever reason, my neighbor was like, oh, now is a good time for me to mow my lawn. I'm like, yeah, I'm over here trying to eat. I'm trying to record. And y'all are over there mowing your lawn. They're like knocking on the window and saying, hey, stop. I'm trying to record. But anyways, guys, it is time for lunch. Easy peasy, beautiful, okay? So for those that don't know, I am a pescatarian, so sometimes I miss having sandwiches, right? I used to love like a turkey and cheese sandwich. Nothing's wrong with that, I just don't eat turkey anymore for whatever reason, y'all. I just, I be going through things, so I'm like, oh, I like it, don't like it the next day, so this is where we're at. So we're gonna do a sandwich. So I have my good seed, I love me some Dave's, y'all. So this is a good seed. I also have Ezekiel bread, because someone did tell me that Dave's was not like the best bread to eat. I haven't had no problems with it. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna toast this. I'm going to use some Mediterranean style hummus. I got this from, uh, where did I get this? H-E-B? Ooh, yeah, okay, here we go. Look at that, look at all that seasoning. Ooh, I knew it. Let me do it one more again. Here is this. We're gonna spread it on our bread. I'm also gonna use some avocado. So I'm just gonna like smash some avocado on there. And then I have cucumber and a tomato or tomato. Tomato, tomato, however you say it, y'all. I say tomato. Tomato. Um, and then I have broccoli sprout. So I had to actually go to Sprouts for this. I feel like no one had it, no one. Sprouts is closer to me than Whole Foods is, so I was, I was really happy about that. So we're just gonna put it all together and then I'm gonna have an apple on the side. Little 
little bit of lemon. I like lemon. Uh oh, I don't like lemon seeds, y'all. Let me take this out. Just gonna put a little salt, a little pink salt. So we have our sandwich with our broccoli sprouts, y'all. Broccoli sprouts are really good. Mm. It's good, but pickles would have been better. <laughs> but this is really good. This is quick. This is something I would pack up and just have for lunch, like if I wasn't at home. An apple a day, baby, an apple a day. We're going to be making salmon lettuce wraps, okay? So, what we have here is some bell peppers. I just like the colors and how it looks when it's on the lettuce. So we have these little mini bell peppers. Um, I love to cook with the lemon whenever I have fish. Some minced garlic. We have our lettuce. Uh, I'm gonna be using this turmeric, parsley, and saffron. Um, just because turmeric is really, really good for good gut health. So I wanna use this. Then we have some um, green onions, asparagus is also really good for you as well. I'm gonna probably top it off with this cucumber and dill tzatziki. Here is our salmon. And then I have a little bit of slappy mama, y'all. Just because I have to have this on everything, I'll probably just put a little, cause I really wanna focus on using the turmeric, parsley, and saffron. Um, and then of course I have like some Salt and pepper. Now look, look at the ratio, guys. I put pepper on everything and I barely touch salt. So, whatever works for you, let's go. First, what I wanna do is I cleaned, washed all my vegetables. So you can also add like carrots, cucumbers to this, but this is what I wanted. So feel free to like kind of mix and match. I know I won't have my scissors, right? Mm-hmm, y'all know. So what we're gonna do is, I don't think I've tried this many at once, but let's see. We'll see how well these work. Ooh, come through, come through. I'm just gonna, boy. <laughs> I'm gonna take the skin off, cause I'm gonna cut these up into like little cubes. You know, I feel like I should be eating sushi. All right, y'all, still gotta put a little bit of my Slappy Mama. I cut up too much vegetables, so I'm going to use a little bit of this, or I may cook it all and then like save it for like, um, leftovers but for now we're just gonna do a little bit no I did not add my garlic so I go back there we go add a little bit of garlic really good. I'm gonna add our fish So let that cook. I have washed, tried to dry, definitely washed. My lettuce, I'm just gonna put it here as if it were a taco. If you have 
cilantro. Cilantro will be really good too. This is good. Yeah, we doing dollops, okay? Ooh, y'all. It smells so good in here. I wish y'all can smell it. Woo! Smells good. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I'm Jay Maxine. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Comment, because I'd love to chit chat and get to know you. And definitely subscribe and hit the notification bell. That way you're notified every time I upload. Guys, I really do hope you enjoyed this and I will definitely see y'all in the next one. Bye guys.